Welcome to the Texas Tech University Honors College December 2020 Medallion Ceremony. Before we begin, we have invited Cable Wilkerson, Class of 2019, member of Citizen Potawatomi Nation, to deliver our land acknowledgement. We would like to acknowledge that Texas Tech University owes its existence and success to generations from across the globe who gave their hopes, dreams, and energy in guiding us to this moment in our history. Some were brought here against their will, others left distant homes in hope of a better future, and some have lived on this land since time immemorial. In the pursuit of reconciliation, acknowledging the truth of our history's intersections is critical and will ultimately determine our path forward. We begin this effort by recognizing the connections between ourselves and the land we reside today upon the ancestral lands of the Comanche and Muscalara Apache peoples, the original stewards of what is now Lubbock and was once the heart of the Comancheria. We pay respects to their elders, past and present. On behalf of the Texas Tech University Honors College, I welcome all of you, family, friends, faculty, staff, and especially our incredible students who have so generously allowed us to walk beside them these last three or four years of their undergraduate experience. And although we are still separated by a screen, know that we are always with you, we are always your community, and we will always be your home. But before we move on to the celebration of our December 2020 graduates, there's another celebration that we must acknowledge. 2020 represents the 20th anniversary of the Texas Tech University Honors College. And while we had celebrations planned, we had exhibits, we had banquets, we had performances, and so much that we wanted to share with you all. COVID-19 in 2020 had other ideas for us. And so while we were not able to come together, we invite all of you to celebrate our 20th anniversary, but look forward to walking this path towards our 25th anniversary in 2025. But we would be remiss if we did not celebrate our alumni, our students, our faculty, our staff, who celebrated with us, who inspired us in every way, and who have given us the strength to continue to grow and to dream onward these past 20 years. What follows is our tribute to the 20th anniversary and the students who make us the Honors College. For the past 20 years. Durante los últimos 20 años. We've invited students to expand their minds. Hemos apoyado a nuestros estudiantes ampliar su conocimiento. To venture outside the classroom and across the globe. A descubrir y aprender fuera de la sala. to speak truth to power. Enfrentarse al poder. And to step forward in times of need. E interesarse en tiempos difíciles. More information about the 20th anniversary is available at honors.ttu.edu forward slash 2020. Celebre 20 años con nosotros a honors.ttu.edu barra 2020. Congratulations, Honors College alumni. Welcome back and welcome home. And happy birthday, Honors College. We are celebrating two decades of the founding of the Honors College, but we look forward to decades and decades more of education, exploration, and inspiration. And what more perfect way to celebrate than by honoring our December 2020 graduates. Traditionally at the December Medallion Ceremony, the Honors College features as commencement speaker, the Honors Distinguished Faculty Member, nominated and voted on by Honors College students. This year, we're shaking things up a little bit. And instead, we have asked the wisest, the most ambitious, the most inspiring, and the most generous community you could ever ask for, our Honors College alumni, to celebrate our December 2020 graduates. This 
this year we celebrate 20 years of the founding of the Texas Tech University Honors College. But, but before, before that, that we, we were a program. program. We were an idea. We were a dream. And it takes many of us, all of us, to make this dream a reality. To take us where we are, nearly 1,600 strong on campus. And over 4,000 strong alumni around the world. We come together today not only to say happy birthday to the Honors College. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Honors College. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Honors College. But to say welcome. Welcome. Benvenidos. Welcome. 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 Welcome to our new family members, the Honors College graduating class of December 2020. We have said too many times over the past 10 months that this is not the graduation we hoped for. We have said too many times over the past 10 months that this is not the way we wanted your senior years to end. We have said too many times over the past 10 months that we live in unprecedented times. But these past 10 months have also allowed time for us to recognize what is most important, what is most cherished, what is most dear. Because we, this family of Honors College alumni, get to celebrate you. And we get to tell you, congratulations. 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 Congratulations, y'all, and Rackham Tech. Congratulations. We believe in you. Rackham! Congratulations and good luck. You can do it. We believe in you. Reckon. Good luck. We believe in you. Good luck. Good luck. Reckon. Good luck. Congratulations, graduates. You did it. We believe in you. Good luck. Reckon. 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 Good luck. We believe in you. Good luck. Bocalupo. Because we live in unprecedented times, you carry with you unprecedented memories and unprecedented strength. We often say that we stand on the shoulders of giants, and we do. But we stand side by side, masks on, and six feet apart, in unity and cooperation, in friendship and community, to help one another stay safe, to face the next challenge ahead, and to work towards a more just and more equal society. Welcome to the Honors Alumni Family. Welcome to the Honors College Alumni Family. Rekha. Welcome to the Honors Alumni Family. Congratulations. Welcome to the Honors Family. Welcome to the Honors College Alumni Family. Welcome to the Honors Alumni Family. Welcome to the Honors Alumni Family. Welcome to the Honors Alumni Family. You are honors. We are honors. 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 Honoring our December 2020 Honors College graduates. We celebrate and honor our December 2020 Honors College graduates who are participants and contributors to our flagship programs. The Bayless Elementary School Mentoring Program, directed by Stacy Poteet. First Year Experience Program, directed by Sarah Timmons. Undergraduate Research Scholars Program, directed by Lori Lightfoot. Honors College Ambassadors, directed by Lori Lightfoot. Each commencement, the Colleges of Texas Tech University select one of their outstanding students to carry the banner of that college during the commencement ceremony. This banner bearer exemplifies the ideals of the Honors College, knowledge, integrity, service, and courage. I would like to present to you the Honors College December 2020 banner bearer, Michael J. Scott. 
Each college was asked to nominate an undergraduate student to serve as the undergraduate university speaker for the December 2020 commencement exercises. We were recently informed that the Honors College candidate, David Rivero, graduating with a degree in finance from the Rawls College of Business Administration and with honors from the Honors College, has been selected to represent the entire undergraduate graduating class of December 2020. We congratulate David, and we look forward to hearing his words of wisdom. Graduating with highest honors from the Honors College. Students who graduate with highest honors from the Honors College have taken on the monumental work of completing an Honors College thesis. This thesis demonstrates a commitment to research, writing, and scholarly production. We are immensely proud of these students who have proven their potential and dedication to advanced intellectual work. Teru Bharadwaj, graduating with a degree in microbiology from the College of Arts and Sciences, with a thesis entitled, Near the End of the Halcyon Era of Earth, Why Human-Induced Climate Change Will Devastate Global Health by Displacing Populations. Thesis advisor, Dr. Alisa Wong, Honors College. Victoria Dennis, graduating with a degree in psychological sciences from the College of Arts and Sciences, with a thesis entitled Mental Health Treatment Effectiveness Among Adolescent First-Time Offenders, an Analysis of Mental Health and Risk Improvement. Thesis advisor Adam T. Schmidt from the Department of Psychological Sciences. Graduating with honors from the Honors College. Christopher Allen, graduating with a degree in Human Sciences from the College of Human Sciences. Kyle Armstrong, graduating with a degree in Biochemistry from the College of Arts and Sciences. Reagan Ball, graduating with a degree in English from the College of Arts and Sciences. Billy Blanton, graduating with a degree in Accounting from the Rawls College of Business Administration. Cody Clark, graduating with a degree in Agricultural Communications from the College of Agricultural Science and Natural Resources. Sydney Kundiff, graduating with a degree in Nutrition from the College of Human Sciences. Matthew Davis, graduating with a degree in Mechanical Engineering from the Whitaker College of Engineering. Yasmin Arabel de Hoya, graduating with a degree in Political Science from the College of Arts and Sciences. Sydney Detheridge, graduating with a degree in kinesiology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Betsaida Delgado, graduating with a degree in microbiology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Alexis Dennett, graduating with a degree in chemistry from the College of Arts and Sciences. Christian Dilalo, graduating with a degree in mechanical engineering from the Whitaker College of Engineering. Liam Ellinger, graduating with a degree in computer science from the Whitaker College of Engineering. Georgina Figueroa, graduating with a degree in English from the College of Arts and Sciences. Mackenzie Ford, graduating with a degree in biology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Brinton Fries, graduating with a degree in architecture from the College of Architecture. Fiba George, graduating with a degree in biology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Sarah George, graduating with a degree in biology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Megan Grisham, graduating with a degree in biochemistry from the College of Arts and Sciences. Anthony Inyoung, graduating with a degree in human sciences from the College of Human Sciences. Lindsay Johnston, graduating with a degree in biology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Jion Kim, graduating with a degree in psychology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Elizabeth Koch, graduating with a degree in sociology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Michael Loftus, graduating with a double major in general studies and biochemistry from the College of Arts and Sciences. Kathy Long, graduating with a degree in biology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Brennan Lowry, graduating with a degree in music from the Talkington College of Visual and Performing Arts. 
Kelsey McDonald, graduating with a degree in civil engineering from the Whitaker College of Engineering. Jacqueline Magno Barroso, graduating with a degree in psychology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Jessica Marsh, graduating with a degree in animal sciences from the College of Agricultural Science and Natural Resources. Eric Moore, graduating with a degree in mechanical engineering from the Whitaker College of Engineering. Elizabeth Morger, graduating with a degree in psychology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Dominika Musoki, graduating with a degree in kinesiology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Kaylee Niebuhr, graduating with a degree in Honors Sciences and the Humanities from the Honors College. Cynthia Okeke, graduating with a degree in Human Sciences from the College of Human Sciences. Haley Reed, graduating with a degree in Animal Sciences from the College of Agricultural Science and Natural Resources. David Rivero, graduating with a degree in finance from the Rawls College of Business Administration. Mary Robinson, graduating with a degree in biology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Joseph Sanchez, graduating with a degree in accounting from the Rawls College of Business Administration. Trey Schwartz, graduating with a degree in history from the College of Arts and Sciences. Megan Scott, graduating with a degree in marketing from the Rawls College of Business Administration. Michael Scott, graduating with a degree in biochemistry from the College of Arts and Sciences. Blaine Siek, graduating with a degree in computer science from the Whitaker College of Engineering. Pablo Smith, graduating with a degree in computer engineering from the Whitaker College of Engineering. Hannah Taylor, graduating with a degree in accounting from the Rawls College of Business Administration. Sarah Thomas, graduating with a degree in biology from the College of Arts and Sciences. Sophia Tran, graduating with a double major, general studies from the College of Arts and Sciences and human sciences from the College of Human Sciences. Garrison Wadford, graduating with a degree in electrical engineering from the College of Engineering. Olivia Williams, graduating with a degree in nutrition from the College of Human Sciences. Joshua Wilson, graduating with a degree in accounting from the Rawls College of Business Administration. Graduates, congratulations, and good luck. Greetings and congratulations. I just want you to know how proud I am of each and every one of you. Thine own self be true. Congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2020. Congratulations. Congratulations, graduates. You did it. Be well and be safe. Congratulations, graduates of the December class of 2020. Well done. We are so proud of you. Congratulations, class of 2020, and awesome job. Congratulations, honest graduates. You're the best of the best. We are so proud of you. Do good in the world. We are so proud of you. Congratulations to all of our December Honors College graduates. You are amazing. Congratulations. Be good in the world. Congratulations, graduates. Congratulations. We are so proud of you. Do good in the world. Congratulations. 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 Honors graduates of 2020. You did it. You are amazing. Do good in the world. Congratulations. We are proud of you. Congrats, class of 2020. Y'all made it. Do good in the world. Congratulations. Muchas felicidades. Congratulations. Congratulations. You are amazing. Do good work. Congratulations. Congratulations. Congratulations, Salvuti. We wish you the best, and we hope that you'll remember us and come back and visit. Congratulations. 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 You'll be missed, class of 2020. We are so proud of you. Congratulations. We are so very proud of you. Do good in the world. Congratulations to all of our Honors College graduates. Yay, you did it. We're so proud of you. We are so proud of you. Congratulations. 
Congratulations. Congratulations. Herzliche Gratulation. Gratuliere, meilleure Felicitation et tanti auguri. We believe in you. We are so proud of you. Way to go. You are amazing. Do good in the world. Congratulations, graduates. We're all very proud of you. Congratulations. I look forward to all that you'll achieve. Congratulations. We believe in you. We believe in you. Congratulations, December 2020 Honors College graduates. We are so incredibly proud of you and so immensely honored that you invited us to be a part of your lives. And in so doing, you became a part of ours, part of our fabric, a part of our family, our lives, the lives of the Honors College faculty and staff, Texas Tech faculty, Texas Tech administrators, Texas Tech staff, faculty from the School of Law and the Texas Tech University Health Sciences Center, our lives were enriched because of you. We often talk about institutions of higher education as training grounds for future leaders, but I actually think that that's a misinterpretation. You are not future leaders. You are current leaders. And every day, in every way, you have already been leading us. All this time, you thought that we were educating you, that we were teaching you, that we were lecturing you, when in fact, you have been the ones teaching us. You have been the ones leading us. You have been the ones inspiring us. We know that our future is safe in your hands. We know that you will continue to make good trouble. We know that you will continue to honor our community, our democracy, and our civic responsibilities to one another. We know that you understand that what we have taught you over these past four years, what you have taught us over these past four years, isn't contained by the four walls of a classroom. That you will continue every single day, in every single way, to pass on that knowledge, to pass on that experience, to pass on that expertise, and to pass it on with graciousness, empathy, and compassion. Together, we have faced unusual times and unusual circumstances. I hesitate to use that term unprecedented because it's been used a little too often, and as a historian, it's a complicated term. I believe we have echoes of the past and resonances of our experiences that inform and, and shape our future. But what is inarguable is that we have experienced loss together. We've experienced absence together. We've experienced isolation together. But I want to remind you that we have also experienced community together in celebrations like these, in moments like these, even when we are separated by a computer screen, even when we cannot be together. Eric Bowie, current Honors College student, and the acapella group The Tech Tones share their song with us in order to remind us that we are so close to the moment in which we can all be together again. And in honor of those, who cannot share that moment with us. To all of you, be safe, be well, congratulations. Here's to the ones that we got. Cheers to the wish you were here, but you're not, cause the drinks bring back all the memories. Of everything we've been through Toast to the ones here today Toast to the ones that we lost on the way Cause the drinks bring back all the memories And the memories bring back memories bring back you There's a time that I remember When I did not know no pain When I believed in forever And everything would stay the same Now my heart feel like December when somebody say your name Cause I can't reach out to call you But I know I will one day, hey Everybody hurts sometimes Everybody hurts someday, hey, hey. But everything gon' be alright Go and raise a glass and say, hey Here's to the ones that we got Cheers to the wish you were here But you're not cause the drinks bring back all the memories Of everything we've been through Toast to the ones here today 
toast to the ones that we lost on the way Cause the drinks bring back all the memories And the memories bring back memories bring back you do 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 Memories bring back memories bring back you There's a time that I remember When I never felt so lost When I felt all of the hatred Was too powerful to stop Now my heart feel like an ember And it's lighting up the dark I carry these torches for you That you know I'll never drop Everybody hurts sometimes Everybody hurts someday eh, eh. But everything gon' be alright Go and raise a glass and say eh. Here's to the ones that we got Cheers to the wish you were here but you're not Cause the drinks bring back all the memories Of everything we've been through Toast to the ones here today Toast to the ones that we lost on the way Cause the drinks bring back all the memories And the memories bring back memories bring back you do 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 do